it's a solo it's it's basically how to duplicate everything like in the forest but like it's solo so it's everything that you can duplicate in the forest but it's just solo so you can, i'm gonna show you how to duplicate everything solo in the forest let me get into this the first thing i'm gonna show you how to do is sticks so sticks and rocks i'm trying to do those the sticks and rocks are like probably the most simple thing you can do so you're gonna want to have well, obviously, my, now my inventory is full, but whatever, I don't need to put them in there. Basically, you want to have it. You don't really need an empty crate, but you want to have an empty crate because it's just easier if you have an empty crate. Because you, can, you could store all your sticks in there, but I'm not going to do that because obviously you can tell they're all three of them are already full. I could make another one, but I don't really want to waste your guys' time watching me make a, <laughs> make a basket. But whatever, let's get into this. The first thing you want to do is have about five to eight sticks. I recommend having about... Recommend, I recommend having five sticks because well, it's just easier. Any more will kind of glitch it up, but it's fine. I do eight because it doesn't really matter. You don't have to have exactly five. You can do as many as you want, but obviously the less you have, the the more you'll be able to duplicate. So obviously if you get five, you'll be able to duplicate 15. If you have eight, you'll be able to duplicate 12. And obviously because I'm going up and up. But basically you want to have the tin the tin tree which if you don't also I forgot to say some of these you don't need to be in a multiplayer world for these some of these you can actually do in your own solo world some of these you have to do in a multiplayer solo world but like basically it's you just set up a multiplayer world and um you can then you can do that everything by yourself solo but that's how you get the tin trays you have to do a multiplayer world but then you can do it solo this thing you have to do in a multiplayer world but whatever so um, basically all you're gonna do is you're gonna put the metal tin tray in the middle then you're gonna hold oh I forgot, I forgot to say i forgot to say you gotta click l2 so you want to hold the stick out like i'm doing right now you want to hold the stick out so i think i'm doing you're gonna hold the stick out then you're gonna put the metal tin tray in the middle then you're gonna hold r2 so all the sticks go into the middle i kind of messed it up but that's what you're gonna do then it'll kind of look like this and then once you pull it out See, it'll still be eight, or well, it, it won't do that all the time. So I messed it up. So you can put the metal tray in the middle. And you're gonna hold R2. You want to kind of find like a good spot, because like you see how I did last time. Like I kind of I had to go to the ends, which didn't, it glitched out. But that's all you're gonna do. See, like did it again. That's all you have to do. Then it'll kind of it'll start to duplicate. But I'm I just I'm so bad at it. It's it's actually easy though. I'm just like really bad at it. So that so I did it. I did it decent. So yeah. So look, I I I have I got it a perfect area. So duplicated two, but you want to like kind of get it right up in this corner, and you're gonna hold R two, and then it would just end up like put all in the middle, and you kind of pull it out, move thirteen, and do the same. Oh, almost forgot. You want to equip the stick, and you keep on doing it over and over again until you get twenty. So obviously I I'm, I keep on glitching it out, but whatever. You'll end up getting twenty once you if you do it like see. Oh, that was that was that was decent. You can kind of just do this the entire time, and it ends up you end up getting 20. But whatever, I'm I'm just so bad at it. So for the rocks, it's obvious it's it's, it's easy to um let's see. Shoot, and I, I don't I think I have max rocks. My bad, guys. My bad. My bad. Oh wait, wait, wait. And there you go. That's fine. Okay. So all you're gonna do is you wanna have about five rocks. Oh, let me grab one. So you're gonna have five rocks. Obviously, same thing. You wanna hold it. Do you wanna hold one out? Like I'm doing. Then you're gonna put it the metal tin tray in the middle, and then just hold R2 the whole time. And I'll do that. Then boom, got ten. See, so it's really easy. Then you can obviously put them all back and stuff. But it's that easy. Oh yeah, that might happen too, where the thing will glitch out. That's fine. Just oh shoot, why is it doing that? Oh, there you go. So that's how you have to do. That's how you do the rocks and sticks. Now let's move on to let's move on to how to duplicate arrows and like stuff in your inventory, anything in your inventory, basically. So let's get into that. Let's go. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you guys how to duplicate arrows. As you can see, I have, I have this entire thing full. I don't know. I think it goes. Up, I think they sold up to 100 each. I like about that's like 200. I think no. I think it holds up to 100 each. I don't know. Yeah, I think it does. It's, that, it's about 100. 200. 200. Sorry. And this is a bone basket, so don't worry about that. Um, so basically, you want to have about, like, like, I did, like I was telling you guys, you want to have about 30 to 30 or whatever you have. So obviously, I do, you can see I duplicated a bunch of cloth. Um, I did duplicate some leaves. I don't know why I was just bored. I just duplicated leaves. Duplicated a bunch of tree saps. I'm also going to show you guys how to duplicate explosives. Um, you know, stuff like that. And obviously, ammo, and pebbles, and all that stuff that you guys were going to need. 
so first I'm going to show you guys how to do is duplicate arrows. This is like the, the most easiest thing ever. So there's two ways you can do this. You can either do how like, you basically just hold R2 and then it goes on to the middle, then you click circle and it duplicates by five. Or you can do the metal tin string in the middle and you put the crafted bow in there or any of the bows, modern bow or crafted bow. Then you just click R2 and you just keep on swapping back and forth with that and see it duplicates. It duplicates so quick. That's literally the quickest method to duplicate arrows. Like, I'm not, it's, I'm not even lying to you. It's the quicked, qu quicked, quickest method to duplicate arrows. Like, I'm not even lying. But basically, I, I'll tell you guys. Basically, you want to put the metal tree in the middle. And you're going to put the crafted bow in there. Any other bow. It can be a modern bow, too, like that. But I'd recommend the crafted bow because it's right there, right next to the arrows. And then you're going to hold R2. And just keep on, just do it. Just go back. But you don't even hold R2. You just have to go back and forth. And just, like, hold the square. Put them all back in the thing. And basically, you're going to obviously you see what's in there you're gonna hold r2 so the arrows go in there see now they're in there then you just tap r2 tap r2 then it'll put the bow in there then it duplicates the 50 again okay, one more time so see now see how that's in there i'll put it out here so look so you can, you're gonna tap r2 on the bow so it goes in the middle but then for the arrows you have to hold r2 oh wait it already duplicated oh my bad but basically um so for the bow the bow has to be the bow has to be like you have to tap R2 for the bow so it goes in and you want to hold for the arrows. And then um that's it. So you want to just tap for the bow, remember that tap for the bow, then hold for the arrows, then I'll duplicate 50. Um we'll see. I'm pretty sure you can do feathers, but you have to like I said, you have to have like 30, so it won't it won't it, sh it probably won't work. So you have to have 30. But I'm pretty sure you can do it the same way, like with the bow. But you want to have 30, but like I said, it's not gonna work. So I'll show you the cloth. So basically, you can see the same as that thing. Just I'm, I'm hold, you, you can either hold it all the way to the end and then let go. See, then it duplicates, but that takes way too long. So you can hold it till you see maybe like 200. Once you see it, once you hit 200, then you can just let go. Then boom, it duplicate. And then wait for 200 again. Duplicate. See. Ya. Um, but obviously, yeah. If you have 30 cloth, which I'm guessing you obviously have more, so you do just put the tin tray in the middle, then hold R2 and just do this the entire time, and then. You just see a certain number that you like, and you just click circle, then boom, that's it. Um, you could duplicate teeth too. Two teeth doesn't matter. I was duplicating those a lot too. So you just hold this, and boom, let go. I'm pretty sure 200 is the max. So yeah, I think 200 is the max. No, it's not. I think it goes up to however many you can get. As you can see. Oh, shoot. But yeah, boom, look. Just do this the entire time. Boom. See, 290. So it's the easiest way to do that. And it's the same with the tree set. I'll do the tree set again. Or not even, I don't think I did show what you said. So boom, then duplicates. Um, so yeah, that's that. Now I'm, gonna sh I'm probably going to put time stamps. Time stamps. Oh, my bad. But yeah, now I'm going to show you guys how to duplicate um, explosives. So explosives you're going to do. You, this, is like, this is so, I'm not even lying. This is the most simplest glitch you're ever going to do. You're going to put one, you guys have two explosives. So you're going to put one in the middle. And they're going to combine it with tree sap. So it's like the, tick, like the sticky one. Don't, don't make it weird, but um, basically it's like, it's like this one like this. So once you have one with the sticky bomb, all you're going to do is you're literally just going to hold R2. That's it. Just hold R2. Just hold R2. And then boom, that's it. Dude, because the five. It's so simple. Like, I'm not, like, dude. It's just, I don't, I don't know. It's just crazy, but I don't know how this patch, going to patch any of this. The plus, yeah, look, you can combine the tree step glitch and this glitch, then boom. Then you'll get infinite amount of sticky bombs. You can combine the tree step glitch and this one, then you're going to be able to get infinite amount of sticky um, bombs so boom boom and hold it so look i just duplicated a bunch of sticky ones so you can do i guess you can choose which one you want if that makes any but that make sense basically basically oh my bad but, but, i'm i'm just stuck bro i'm just cr i'm just like just i'm just like it's just crazy this is even still here basically i guess you could choose one you want so if i wanted to get the sticky ones i'm just gonna hold our two on that one first oh wait Maybe not, maybe not. But basically, I guess all you're gonna do for the ones that you want, like so, let's say I want to duplicate, um, let's say I want the sticky ones, like say I want the sticky bombs, then you're gonna hold on the other one first. So you're gonna, so basically, I have one sticky bomb, and then one not, and then one not sticky bomb, or one sticky so or whatever. So you're gonna hold, you're, you're gonna want to hold on that one first, and then go to the sticky bomb, then it'll duplicate all the sticky bombs. Am I doing it wrong again? What? I just did it. I just did it earlier. I duplicated a bunch of sticky bombs. I, I don't know. I'm I'm like I'm tweaking. Bro. Ooh, put one 
into my oh my god oh dude that's scary man I see that red light I'm like oh I'm about to blow up but basically yeah, I just keep on doing that so that's literally the most simplest thing I've ever to do do that and put this in the middle and just go boom that's it and that's it so boom and then you can just keep on doing that to get all your sticky bombs or whatever you want that's the, the most simplest thing you can do. So, um, there you go. So that's it. That's how, that's how you get all your sticky bombs. You can literally just use that to just destroy um, the mutants and stuff. They just blow up every single mutant you see. So that's it. That's literally it for the sticky bomb. Then if you end up having like one sticky, then one not sticky, then you don't have to redo the sticky thing. You can just keep on doing like that. You don't have to redo the sticky um, that first step. So that's it. Well, I'll show you how to duplicate that. Now I can show you. I'll show you guys how to duplicate. You know, I see. I'm not even. I'll try to find you guys how to duplicate rabbits. Like I'll find some way to duplicate rabbits, and I'll show you guys. I'll find some way to do it. But um, yeah. That's it for the sticky bombs and everything. It will everything inventory. Um, 